So I'm, I need to scratch out all those questions about the Wes Anderson Fantasy Football League that, uh, that, that, that those don't exist. Pretty much. <laughs> Is there one? That would be great. <laughs> you know what I mean? Tilda Swinton's not drafting anybody in her fantasy football. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> I'm telling you, that would that would that would really catch on. <laughs> What <laughs> is it? Is coming in. <laughs> Here comes. I don't know, man. So, uh, all right. So, what is it like on a Wes Anderson set? Walk me through what that's like, Adrian um, Brody. Well, they vary. You know, I, I've been fortunate to work with Wes for for many years now, and um, you know, I, I just think he's just such a wonderful person, aside mm-hmm. from his enormous talents as a filmmaker. And um, you know, the one thing that I find most unique is that he creates this environment that's so welcoming and um, really it's like a family. It's like a, a, a troop of, of uh, players joining a, you know, an ensemble and, and everyone, you know, everyone's welcome to the table li- literally and, and figuratively. And, um, you know, it's, it's, it's great. And the, the key, key members of the crew have been a part of his team for decades are, are all there and you know we we dine and, uh, at night and we sit together and uh you know have a life together and 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 you know most films um even though you're on location at times and you might vibe with one or two people you you live a pretty isolated mm-hmm. time you know you you everyone has their work to do so you're you're kind of off on your own preparing and then you have your family or friends that may join you and but it's really not as um connected and and i love that about wes and then on the creative side you know he's just so it's so unique i mean the style in which he shoots requires a a level of uh focus and uh coordination it's 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 some so much of it is a dance between all the departments and the other actors and and uh there aren't he doesn't cut away and and do a lot of coverage so you do these elaborate moving master shots and that that there's no room for error there's no room for you to take a breath or stutter or wow miss miss a beat or miss a word or for anyone else to miss a beat or a word or for the dolly to not land where you land or for you to not land where you're supposed to land etc and and it's so it's it's amazing when it when it works it's amazing um and you see it in his films but it's uh it's uh it sure is a unique process do you have a favorite bill murray story from a set or anything <laughs> well, you, got, you got one for me Anybody? i have some i can't really share oh my um, god but um we were watching what were we watching it's um we were watching the football uh, the the soccer um you know football play uh, sure. like finals the, in in uh, and when we were in Cannes, so I don't know, yeah, so, and we were, we were, it was the the last moments, and we all had a dinner, and, mm-hmm. uh, of course, uh, Owen Wilson and Bill excused themselves, and were down at the, you know, at the hotel bar watching the game, and, mm-hmm. and, uh, and then we all joined them towards the end, and there were, you know, they were they were complete strangers there on their European vacation, uh, also sitting in this kind of lounge area, and Bill would just come up and like throttle them and sp- spill water on them and <laughs> cheer on the team. So, so okay, so it I think amazing. I think this is the really UEFA amazing. Cup. They, they, this is the European they had a good sense of humor about it. Right, these are like the Euro. I think it was the Euro championship right chris yes. this this yeah, yeah from over the summer from yeah. over the summer and so you're saying uh-huh. just regular patrons of this establishment yeah, some, are just some, there you know italian <laughs> tourists were visiting france and rooting you know, watching the game and you know bill was you know literally over their shoulders on the couch from behind you know <laughs> bringing in the american muscle it was really something <laughs> It's it just something. I bet, I bet, <laughs> just being around him. And then I, I could see yeah. Henry Winkler, correct, is part of the cast this time around? Oh, yeah. I mean, yeah, it's... Henry plays my uncle, uh, my character's uncle. Mm-hmm. Um, and um, he's so wonderful. We just did a Q&A together in L.A., and he was really the star of the show. Mm-hmm. Everyone loved him, and he's so funny. and um, Nicest guy on planet people. Earth, right? Like, literally one of the sweetest people you'll ever meet Isn't on he? planet Isn't Earth. Isn't he like, so so sweet and uh 
I know, and we're we're right around the same age. We're right around the same age, Adrian. And I, I, you know, anytime I've ever gotten to talk to him, and he's interviewed on the show, I'm like, this is the Fonz, and I cannot I believe know. like the Fonz is like truly like one of the sweetest, gentlest, <laughs> purest <laughs> driven snow individuals on planet Earth. Like, what a great I actor know. he is, right? I mean, I told him I was. Always, I always dreamt he'd be my uncle. <laughs> you know, he's just such a. He's so great. Did you ever ask him to like you know hit, hit something and turn it on just by hitting it with his shoulder or with his arm or something no, like that? No, I, mean, I, I didn't <laughs> give him. I didn't give him. Uh, no, I am sure he's had that too much. Right. Exactly. Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.